again and welcome back to Scotland Wonders World. How are you doing? Hope you're all keeping well. Um, there's some new beers in various supermarkets. Uh, you've got some in Asda, you've got some in Morrison's. Uh, we've had the little bits and pieces into uh, Lidl lately. We've had the King's Jubilee stuff into Aldi. Oh, very good, isn't it? Um, so the biggest range of beers appears to have dropped into Asda. Um, we've got two Asda near uh, as does as the associated dairies uh near us one's actually on ports in, on ports the island in ports and we've got one that's in haven slash lee park just off the a3 for people that know haven't um it used to be called the old haven't hypermarket now it's as the owned by walmart i think are they these days well unless they were sold off um so i thought i'd bring you over and we take a look at the the new range together we're going to have a word with the security guard, see if he'll give me permission to film. If he doesn't, then obviously we'll, we'll, you're not going to see this video, because I'm not going to film and sort of clandestine. Um, I like to sort of do things properly, I try and get permission to film. So, I'll take you in, show you outside, um, I won't walk you inside, I'll just show you, I don't plan on showing uh, fellow customers and things like that, because obviously uh, GDPR and sort of privacy rules and things like that. So yeah, I'll see if, see if the, um, the guy will let me film. Um, and hopefully I'll be able to show you the new range of stuff that's currently in Asda, hopefully, near you. See you in a minute. So this is the Asda Hypermarket, or you used to be the Asda Hypermarket, uh, Hypermarket now with the huge Asda. So we'll go in and see what they've got, see if we've got any of the new ones. So, shout out to the wonderful security guard at Haven um, Asda. His name's Scott as well. And uh, he um, got hold of one of the managers. I said, as long as I only film the actual beers themselves and no customers, then I'm allowed to do it. So thank you very much, Scott. Um, oh, it's a place to be polite and sort of friendly, doesn't it? So we'll show you the, the actual beer range you have. So you've got Castile, Brewdog, Devel 666, normal Devel. You've got Castile Rouge, which is new, and that's £2.75. You've got Devel Triple Hot. Uh, uh, punk IPA, and then we get down to some of the newer stuff. So we've got, I don't know if Baby Food Assassin's been around for a little while. Um, not seeing root, uh, Roots Rock Reggae, Pineapple and Grapefruit IPA. That's three pounds. This is the one I picked up yesterday. The Southfield Hop. Uh, you've got Michaela Hazy IPA. This is one of the new ones. So David Thompson told me about this, the um, Northern Correspondent. This is from Tooth and Claw. And this is their Cat Amongst, a tropical IPA, 5.1%. There's a straight up hazy. A juicy New England style IPA loaded with tropical fruit flavours from the late hop combination of citra and mosaic. A tooth and claw out of. Oh, Durham. County Durham. What else have we got anything new? So we've got Tom Coco, that's been around for a little while, I think. Continuum, oh, I haven't seen that before, from North. A American Pale Ale, that one's £3. Can't go wrong with a North beer, really, can you? 5.5% ABV. Uh, Brewgooder and Overtone uh, out of Scotland, which is Juicy Pale Ale. Down here, I've got uh, Love and Hate, another Tooth and Claw. This one looks like it's fairly new. From Siren, Smart Casual. Juicy IPA. This one's three pound. We got another salt beer or a salt beer. That's alpaca. That used to be in Sainsbury's, I believe, at one point. Me and Wanda actually reviewed this some time ago and got into a bit of an argument because she actually thought there was an alpaca fur in the beer. NFT2, uh, which is salt and guaylo. I think I did have um, NFT, never sort of put it on the channel. And I can't actually remember anything about it. All of these are three pound. 
another uh, nice to see salt having a half decent um, footprint in the supermarket. So you got the Hop Sabro. They do. They've done. Uh, they've done Citra and Mosaic. I think of them. I've got anything else that looks a bit new. Don't mess with Yorkshire. Rhubarb and custard pale ale. I've got a feeling that's been rebranded and renamed. I'm sure that was out last year sometime. Uh, neon jungle. A grey low. I don't know what it is. Oh, jungle IPA. Neon jungle IPA. Interesting. Look at this man's way. A bit further up, they've got um, Erdinger four pack, six pound. Got Faith, twelve pound. Huckerback, what's that? That's a six by four forty mils. That's eleven. It's also over there that caught my eye. Uh, Thornbridge Astrid, two pound a bottle. Okay, well, that ain't bad, is it? Three point eight percent ABV. Well, get one then. Then you've got the brew dog stanchion over here. Someone's going to get the sacklet. <laughs> Faith in Hayes. Oh, that's been around for a little while. Well, that's new. That's three pounds. They've got left hand cans, but they haven't got any in. Songbird. They haven't got any in. I think that Songbird's a North beer, isn't it? You've got this Neon Dream that's been doing the rounds, I think, a little bit. Anything else? Oh, we've got another one. Bottle conditioned bitter, Lord Marples from Thornbridge. Might pick one of them up as well, actually. And I think that's it for the new stuff. So there's a fair few. What have we got? We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight. Nine, about ten, ten new beers. And there's a couple. There's one that I want. There's a Motorhead beer. It doesn't look like they've got it in here at the moment. So yeah, um, thank you very much to uh, the lovely security guard Scott. They let me film, and he got hold of one of the managers as well. They confirmed it. So always be polite. And um, yeah, pick a couple up while I'm here. So yeah, a couple of new, a few new beers into Asda, um, but certainly into this one. I'm coming in there fairly regularly and sort of just checking out this. So they've moved things around a little bit. So Brewdog have got their own little stanchion now. There's a Northern Monk one in there, so someone for the high jump. Um, and we got some. T this is some Tooth and Claw. I've not had anything for Tooth and Claw. Uh, there's some new from Salt. Uh, also good to see Salt in um, a supermarket. Generally very very good. From what I can remember, Alpaca was a decent beer as well. Um, this is a new Thornbridge. I've picked up two, two of the new Thornbridges, um, Astrid and Astrid and Lord Marples. So two pound each. Only 500, 500 mil bottles. 500 mil bottles. Can't go wrong, can you? Um, potentially doing a live later. They're both fairly low ABV, although I'm off tomorrow, so it doesn't really matter. Um, so yeah, um, thank you ever so much to Scott the security guy who contacted the manager for me um, and allowed me to film. Um, also appreciated. Um, don't we go in there and sort of clandestine film unless you absolutely have to. So um, yeah, get yourself up to Asda or I've got no local bottle shops anymore so I can't support them. So yeah, wherever you get your beer from, you've got a local uh, uh, favourite brewery, get your beers from them as well. Try and support where we can. Um, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't, give it a thumbs down. Subscribe if you're that way inclined and me and want to see you soon.